Ladies and gentlemen, we are on the Husqvarna's, the Zvart Pillen and the Vit Pillen. Get to try both side by side. First off is the Zvart Pillen. These are 400, 399cc. Wow, she's smooth. Now this one is completely stock at the moment. Literally, they're just getting these bikes. That one has a uh, slip-on and a tag delete already. They're both still in their break-in periods. Wow, how smooth this thing is. And it's very lightweight up top. These are very grounded bikes. Like the weight is rides lower. Very flickable ride. Light on its feet. The peg position on this bike kind of makes you feel uh, it's casual, but it also doesn't feel like uh, I got to hang on for life. Like you are in a position that kind of a little lean forward. My feet are a little set back. It's very comfortable. We got more of an upright bar on this one. The bit pillin is more of a that truer to that cafe style and man these bikes are just precise like you feel like you can put it exactly where you want it with effortlessly i'm gonna say are some of the fastest in its class they will get up and move if you want it to but it also will ride in a way that is very chill and calm i guess what i'm trying to say is uh, you're not going to uh, accidentally throw yourself off. Not that you can't move some booty around. You hit that third gear and you better hold on. And what we noticed right out of the gate, because both of these bikes have the exact same motors, these bikes like that high RPM. That's a nice Subi. They like to be revved. You can tell they're happiest up in the high revs, which is fun. You don't feel like you're beating it up. What a smooth, just the braking is smooth. Nothing harsh. Shifting is like butter. It's got ABS. And it just feels like a very, these bikes feel very confident, like you're very secure. Uh, it didn't take much time at all to just feel very just like, I don't want to say easy because these bikes, bikes are not, you know, necessarily easy to ride. But it does, it just inspires you to just feel comfortable and confident. You feel like you can kind of do no wrong, which is kind of a lie because you can totally do wrong, obviously. But it feels like a very forgiving type of throttle and power, power range. Like I feel like I could huck it across the state of Florida on this and, and not have a problem. Or just ride around commuting to town. How how sweet would this be? This one obviously comes with a different little styling of tank. You got a rack on the tank. It's pretty neat. You have all your stuff in front of you. But yeah, I mean, what can you say? It's they're just feel like quality built bikes. After you you've been looking at something and wanting to do something for a long time, you kind of hype stuff up. And I did, I hyped the 401 up. I mean, this was the bike. I just drooled over these bikes and drooled over these bikes. And after finally getting to uh, ride them, they are every bit of awesomeness I had hoped. You know, it's kind of like 
meeting that celebrity they tell you don't meet your celebrity because it ruins it or well, 401s negate that you could just romp all over with these now obviously this one has more of a dual sport type tire they feel very nice you don't feel like when you're on the road that you're on necessarily a dual sport type tire it definitely feels very secure in the dirt it is just a package I mean come on these things are just gorgeous they stand out I think uh, the, the boys had told me even one guy had come up and was like is this real yeah they're pretty real don't really know what you mean by that okay we're doing a little switch up the vit pillin this one definitely has more of that cafe that just classic cafe look which both of these bikes are in that retro genre but it's like the future met with the old and bam there you go this is obviously going to be more of a leaned in aggressive stance and did i tell you these bikes are lighter than a feather and this one's obviously got the slip on did you get any more gorgeous of a spot jeez man come on gotta love florida so right out of the gate i feel like i am ready to attack the turns on this one it has got that cafe feel and these are factory bars they're kind of like a clip-on style bar look looking you know these are these same bikes just stanced and styled a little different and i'm gonna tell you the truth I don't know which one I would pick. Premium machines, you can just feel it. With that slip-on on here, that's the one thing I would definitely do right out of the gate, is it, they're so quiet. Uh, it can be a little hard to know when, when you should be shifting. It sounds good, it's not obnoxiously loud, it's just a nice tone. It's just, that KTM motor, it, it sounds lovely we'll take these out we'll do some pulls on them and these things are so flickable i mean even though this is stanced up and i'm leaned in for me i can still go some distance on this thing it does not feel uncomfortable i don't feel like in the next hour i'm going to be hurting like you feel a little more ready to attack with this but it is not uncomfortable in any way tut tut looks like rain we're going to do some pulls for you so, first gear roll, here we go, yeah boy, Woo. yeah buddy, they move guys, they pillin, yes. All right, doing a pull on the Zvart pillin. We're gonna do a first gear roll. Okay. They feel so similar guys when it comes to the power they scoot some beautiful machines right here ladies and gentlemen okay ladies and gentlemen I appreciate you guys if you got to this point if you found this video enjoyable or helpful in any way hit that like button if you want to see more like this in the future hit that subscribe button and we'll see you on the next one